Hello, hello, hello. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, Coach Tom, uh, first week of training in the books here with the Philippine men's national team. How does it feel to get your first camp uh, done and dusted? Yeah, a good feeling to be honest. Uh, a great arrival, uh, talking a lot with uh, the board, with the people in the management and then getting on the pitch with a lot of motivated players. All the boys who are here have a lot of talent. We had young boys, we had more experienced boys. It was a mixed group, but it was a great experience and it helps me a lot in the preparation uh, to the coming Iraqi games. And uh, working with the staff, it, it was a very good uh, kickoff. Now it's rather unusual for the men's national team to have such a big group of university players, even a high school player who was involved. Tell us about uh, how you felt about the level that they brought to the training and uh, what you're looking forward to uh, moving forward with them in this setup. To be honest, uh, when I heard high school players and, and university players, I was a little bit skeptical. Uh, but the moment I saw the players already on the pitch, uh, because I went to watch some games, and when they came here to, uh, to train with us, all of them were fantastic players. And I'd have to say huge respect for all the coaches in the country. If you work on club level, university or high school level, uh, I think the, the, the youth coaches, development coaches, and also the first team coaches, they make a very good work because the players who I received here were all very quality players with a lot of skills, the right mentality, and uh, it was a pleasure to work with them. The, the team will be in Dubai preparing for the big match against Iraq, first away and then back home here at the Zell Memorial Stadium. Uh, tell us a little bit about what's on your plate now as you prepare for those big FIFA World Qualifiers matches. Yeah, it will be a tough match. We know that Iraq is the big favorite, the strongest team. For me, they were a favorite to win uh, the championship in, uh, in Qatar in the Asia Cup and probably they can qualify for the World Cup. Um, so we have nothing to lose. Uh, they, we are the underdog, they are the favorite. And going there, playing a full stadium, almost 68,000 people can be there. It will be a special experience for all of us. And uh, my experience say that we have to enjoy it. We have to be well prepared, but we have to also switch on and say, enjoy these games. You don't play these games every week uh, and even not every year. Uh, we're going to analyze our opponent more in detail. I have my specialist uh, already working on it. We will make a final selection and then uh, coming, uh, to, uh, coming to 18 March, we will regroup the whole group uh, or in Dubai and later in Iraq. Um, and we will prepare the team uh, for, for a strong battle. We don't want to come home without any point. We want to win something there. Even how difficult it is, we never start the game uh, to lose it. And I, I really believe that uh, with the right uh, tactics, with the right motivation and the right spirit, we can achieve a lot. But Iraq is the favorite and it will be a very tough task.